Hello everybody, it's Hegan here. I'm back with another video for you guys. And today's video for you guys is a book and Blu-ray update for Saturday, March 11th, 2023. And for today's update, I got three books and six Blu-rays to show. Now, I'll point out where I got everything in this video, but I did get everything yesterday when I went shopping. Now I did show all these things in a vlog video and a community tab post that I uploaded yesterday, but I'm still going to do this video anyways because I can. So uh, yeah, let's not, let's not waste any more time and let's get started with the update. Starting with the books, which all three of these books I got at We Book In yesterday. The first two are paperback books. This is a short story from Gillian Flynn. I do have a uh, Gone Girl, Sharp Objects, and um, Dark Places. Those are great books. There are 79 pages in this book. I have the 2008 film adaptation of this book on Blu-ray. And I now have the book that the, the film was adapted to. No, that the, that the film was based on. Excuse me, got my words mixed up. This is a 1995 book. And originally a German book. There's 218 pages in it. And the last book is a hardcover copy. And a first edition as well. This is a 1972 book. I do have the 2004 film adaptation on VHS. I will get the original film adaptation someday. And it's got a signature on it. From who I'm assuming was the original owner of this book. Oh, sick. This book has 145 pages in it. And those are the books. Now onto the Blu-rays. The first two Blu-rays I got from the junk seller yesterday. This is a movie I've been wanting to check out for the longest time and now I finally have it. This is a Paramount Vantage movie. It's got a little tear on the side there, but that's all right. On the back here, but that's all right. Paramount Vantage movie co-produced with DreamWorks Pictures and BBC Films. This one was also brand new sealed when I got it. I forgot to mention in the video that I did yesterday, but this was brand new sealed when I got it. A movie I do want to check out, although I hear mixed things about this movie, I do want to check it out because it seems interesting to me. And I do like some of Gore Verbinski's movies like the Pirates of the Caribbean movies, the American remake of The Ring, and uh, Rango and so on. I hate it when the... hate it when this slip cover won't just come down when the thing won't come out there we go twentieth century fox movie co-produced with Regency Enterprises and Blind Wink there's the blu-ray there's the DVD. Digital code may not be valid after 2019, so I'm a, I'm guessing this code already expired. The last four Blu-rays I got from 
the lobby, which was a store I went to. And this next one's a Criterion Collection Blu-ray. A movie I do want to check out. This is my first Terrence Malick film that I bought. And this will probably be the first one I ever watch. Spy number 536. Twentieth Century Fox movie, Copies of Phoenix Pictures. There's the disc. Not gonna go through the book late in this video. This one I actually did watch last night, and it was actually a great movie. I actually really enjoyed it. It was a great vampire movie. This is my first Warner Archive Collection Blu-ray that I have. Although, this is an MGM movie. Nineteen eighty-three movie, by the way. The last two Blu-rays are Scream Factory releases. Finally got Candyman Farewell to the Flesh. I have the first Candyman on Blu-ray as well in a Scream Factory release. I'm not in a big rush to getting the third one or the 2021 remake. I hear the third one's the worst one. And I hear mixed things about the 2021 remake. This is what the cover was when I bought it, but then I switched it over, because why not? Last Blu-ray for this update. A movie I've been looking for for the longest time, and now I finally have it. This is from the same director as Titane, which I have on Blu-ray. I love that movie. And I've actually been wanting to check this movie out since I saw Titane in theaters back in 2021. This is a 2016 movie. And that's the update. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, comment below, subscribe, turn on notifications, follow me on my other social medias, and share the video with your friends. But uh, thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a great day. And until next time, this is Keegan Shepard signing off. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a great day, everybody. Peace out. Bye.